In this problem, we're being asked to calculate the surface area of a triangular prism. A triangular prism has five sides, five faces. There, there's this rectangle on the top here. That's um, 7 by 13. There's the rectangle underneath where this thing is sitting on the tabletop or wherever. That one's 7 by 12. And there's this rectangle at the back here, and that looks like it's 7 by 5. And in addition to the three rectangles, there are two triangles. So you can see them on either side. So the triangle on this side, the triangle on this side. So we need to figure out the area of all five of those parts and just add them together. That will give us the surface area of this triangular prism. Let's start with the triangles. Um, this is a right triangle. So we can take the base as 12 and the height as 5. So the area of a triangle is 1 half the base times the height. So this would be 1 half of 12 times 5. And let's see, 1 half of 12 is 6 times 5. So that's 30. So 1 triangle equals 30. We're going to have two triangles. So, so far, I've got 30 plus 30. All right, let's start with these rectangles. Let's start with the biggest one. 7 times 13. That's the dimensions of this first one. That is 91. So plus 91. Let's do the, uh, the underneath. So we've got... Uh, this one is 12 times 7, and that is 84. And then the back here, it's 5 by 7, so that's 35. Now all we need to do is add all of those together. So let's see, 60 plus 91 plus 84 plus 35. And it looks like this is 270, and the units are centimeters. This is area. So it's square centimeters. And that is how to calculate the surface area of a triangular prism.